from the Cultural Arts Council of Douglasville, Georgia. It's about bloomin' time. Hey there, this is Kathy Klugfelter coming from uh, my studio. I was hoping to get to see everybody at the Cultural Arts Center in Douglasville, but uh, we're in a shelter in place, so I'm lucky enough to get to shelter inside my studio. I'd pan around for you, but I didn't prepare to have visitors. And I think a lot of you would find that uh, when art happens, it's always not a Pinterest uh, beautiful finished project. So I was notified about this exhibit about a year ago and I sent in my first pictures. Uh, I sent in a work of my daughter uh, dancing by the water. Uh, it's one of my favorite paintings. It's 36 by 48 and I just love it. And it's got a lot of energy and I was trying to come up with works that are blooming. Originally I first started with the thought of flowers obviously blooming. Then I moved to children so I have several works that are about children. And then I thought about the works themselves. How does artwork bloom? And from that, I started with looking at my process. Lots of times I'll sit down and I'll just paint something uh, because that's what I'm in the mood for. Lots of times I paint because that's what the paint is in the mood for. Uh, I have an image in my head I can't always recreate the image in my head. Sometimes the paint has a mind of its own and you've got to go with where the paint wants you to go. Behind me, I have a series of sunflowers. Pretty much the same painting in three completely different styles. Uh, obviously, I'm not doing an exhibit of sunflowers, but I poured out too much yellow paint. So why are there so many sunflowers? Because I poured out too much paint and I can't waste it. And three completely different paintings, three different feels, three different energies. A lot of my works for this exhibit are painted on top of former works. I paint these for me and I enjoy the process. I enjoy getting to paint. It's what I love to do and it makes my heart happy. A lot of these paintings don't make it past my walls. They end up behind me on this wall or some of my other gallery walls and I look at them and I see where they need to go. If you go to my website, www.myartplane.com, uh, you can look at the current exhibit, It's Blooming Time, and see where these works started from. Uh, although all the original photos are not there, uh, a lot of them are. And you can see how these paintings developed from one painting to another. The composition stayed the same in some. Uh, layout stayed the same. I started this exhibit with thinking about children and how they bloom. Uh, this is a 30 by 48 acrylic on canvas painting. Uh, one of my favorite quotes that's attributed to Audrey Hepburn is, to start a garden is to believe in tomorrow. And I think we all need to believe in tomorrow a whole lot right now. I started my art career at the University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill. I have a BFA in Fine Arts in Painting and 3D Ceramic Design. I studied Classical Oil Painting and we were never ever allowed to paint with acrylics because that was plastic and one never ever paints with plastic. 
So in later years, yes, I have picked up acrylics and I love it and I've had the best time with it. Uh, many of the paintings you may know me from around town are these mosaic cats. Uh, I started with acrylics playing with those and I was lucky enough to win an honorable mention at the Novus exhibit uh, a couple years back with one of my mosaic cats. And they've really taken off and people tend to respond to them and I love them but my love 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 when it comes to paint is oil. I have a really hard time being non-representational. Anytime I put down paint, it becomes something, a place, a something. I have a very hard time painting air. Uh, whenever I go to a doctor's office, I'm like, wow, somebody bought that painting. It looks like it's a painting of air. There's paint smudged here and it's smudged there and it's non-representational and it's always beautiful, but I can't do it right here. You can see where I tried to paint air, and yes, my air became landscapes, and that's okay. I'm still working on it. Uh, it's just not my thing. I can't get there. I can't make my hands do it. I know it looks easy, but hey, one day maybe I'll get there. <laughs> Have a safe and happy day. Thanks. And now, a dramatic recreation of my daughter dancing on the beach.